We now have Kirk that just formed. It is a tropical storm. Now it's thousands of miles away from us. This is not going to be an issue here, folks. That's not the one I'm watching. The other one I'm watching too, right off the west coast of Africa. That's something long term. Yes, we're going to turn our attention to. Joyce is going to be out of here pretty soon. But the one I'm watching is over towards portions of the Caribbean. Take a look at Kirk's track. It's tracking right back out to the water, which is great news. Meanwhile, this area of low pressure could be what comes next. This is where we actually got the previous system from Hurricane Helene. So here's the American model. It wants to pull up something, a low pressure system by next Monday, Tuesday, potentially impacting the panhandle. And then here's a European starting to try to jump on board. It has an area of low pressure that's going to try to come for Tampa. But either way, it looks like a very weak system. We have a lot of time to figure out exactly what it could be, the impacts it'll bring. But for right now, it just looks like a pretty big rainmaker for us heading into early next week. No major hurricane or anything like that that I see in the forecast. So that's promising. But hey, a rainmaker would not be good. We don't want any more flooding.